If you're into Warhammer 40k, you may have noticed that a number of evil bad guys have these wacky pipes and tubes stuck in their heads. Horus, Perturabo, Angron, and Abaddon are just a few examples off the bat. But why? It doesn't look particularly fun or aesthetic. Well, the answer kind of depends. Angron's tubes are his butcher's nails, a torture device that triggers rage and aggression, blocking off his dopamine receptors and giving him artificial highs whenever he bathes in the blood of his enemies. However, for the others, their tubes are a bit less spicy. Basically, the tubes allow them to upload a battlefield and tactical data straight to their brain. This device was originally created and used by Perturabo. When Horus went to the dark side, he began using them as well, and since Abaddon is the least original character ever created, he also jumped on the bandwagon. Guys, I swear he's not just a bitch Horus. This likely isn't the tube's only purpose though. They could easily be used to pump stims directly into the brain or allow a pressure release from the mental gymnastics required to justify selling your soul to the forces of hell and then trying to claim that you aren't the bad guy. 